Yo, this story is so crazy. Okay, so I, I, I got to ask you, you went with Atlantic. Do yeah. you remember how much you signed for? $60,000. How much of that was in advance? Um, I got an $11,200 advance. <laughs> <laughs> I remember what, and, and I didn't, I was scared to cash it. I was walking around with an $11,000 check for like, three weeks in my pocket. I'm like, yo, I don't know what I'm gonna get. I'm gonna get a fat rope. <laughs> That's all I was thinking about. I'm gonna get this medallion <laughs> and I'm gonna get a, I don't know. I wanted a, I wanted a Volks. I got a Volkswagen. I got a convertible Volkswagen. <laughs> That's no, what I got. You're telling me, see, this is the crazy thing, but we talking 89. Yeah. And we also talking the, the, the very early stages of this new genre of music called rap that we know yeah. is a billion dollar industry today but you signed a deal back then for sixty thousand dollars with Yo. an eleven thousand dollar advance sixty thousand dollars and that was to make it that was to make an ep and i turned in an album i was like i ain't coming out with no ep <laughs> so i turned in a whole <laughs> album which was only eight cuts, but they wanted me to do five. So I'm like, nah, nah, I want to make an album. Like, you can't be having, like, what's an EP? I, I thought it was like a sucker move. Like, what the hell is an EP? <laughs> um, and so, so yeah, it was 60000 for that. And then it doubled for the next album. But still, still no, I, I, not, I, you at, know. At 16 years old, you got $11,000 in your pocket. You think I'm a millionaire. Like, b bottom line. This yeah, I didn't, yeah, I didn't know what to do. But luckily, I wasn't on the dummy stuff, so I didn't like trick it out. Matter of fact, the the main thing I did was put aluminum siding on my mom on my mom's home. That's what the most of the money went to. Now Are you I think serious? about it, I put aluminum siding on the home. I bought a fifteen hundred dollar fat rope that I never wore, and. And I wore it on the album cover <laughs> and tucked in a sweater in a in a shirt. And um I I got a car. The car was the car was twenty two thousand and I probably put five thousand on it and paid it off like that summer or something crazy. That's it. Oh a rims. I got a rims and a Benzy yeah, box. <laughs> And and said your, first car, box. Huh? your first car was a Volkswagen. Yep. Volkswagen Cabriolet convertible. And, and your man Puff jacked me. Your man Puff saw my yeah. car and went and got the same car. I know he did it because he told me he jacked. Oh, no. Gets, gets, I remember when Puff was driving around in that drive. He got the, he got the maroon one. And I was like, come on, man. Come on. I'm like, Yo, why are you? Hold up, hold up. Because, because, because I'm going to actually ask him this. You telling me that he jacked it from you? 100%. 100%. 100. Don't let him lie. Do not let him lie about that. He definitely jacked. Because I was the only one with the convertible Volkswagen. Only one. And I was all over the place. I was uptown. I was in Yonkers. I was all Puff seen the car and he wanted the car and he jacked it. Trust me. I used to drive. I used to drive. Me and Puff. I'm not even gonna blow nobody up. But me and Puff used to know the same people in a particular dorm in Howard. So when I'd be in the dorm, he would be at the dorm, and I'd pull up, and he was like, "Oh man, that car's dope." Yeah, do not jack me, man. He went <laughs> turn around, and jack me. Oh man. Okay. Oh, crazy story. Yo, this dude Puff, he been at it for years, man. Like, come on, P, you're jacking my man's ride, his whip. Come on, ride. man. It's just a Volkswagen. <laughs> oh, my God. All right. Um, and, and here's the crazy thing, because people don't realize just how far back people go. You, you yeah, told yeah. Me, you were seeing Puff when he was in Howard. Like, yeah. Like, people don't realize, like, like, you see people when they blow, and you think that, they just blew out of nowhere. It's yeah, so yeah. much history. It's yeah, he fun. would be on. Come on, man, he would be on the road with us if I was doing shows with with Father MC. Puff would be right. That's how I know him. Like I don't know him through anything else, but Howard and and on the road with Father. Wow. Yeah. Wow.
What's up guys? Thanks for sticking with me to the end of the video. Truly appreciate you. If you like anything you heard here today, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. And if you know anybody that can benefit from this message, feel free to share. Peace and love. Make every move a power move. And I'll catch you all on the next video.